Alright, so we'll start off by going up here. Go to all classes and search for the Cine Camera Actor. And get one of them out. Put it wherever you want. I'm just going to put it where I want to start. Save that. And I make a new level sequence. So I'm going to name this. And then you can hold control and scroll on your mouse wheel to zoom in and out. And then you can drag your camera actor in here. And there's a little pilot button to stop piloting. Then you can go down here to transform. Add the keyframe. And then drag across to somewhere else. I'm going to go right to the end. And then you can pilot your camera somewhere. And add another keyframe to the transform. And you can preview it by dragging through. I'm going to stop that and close that. And then we're going to go up here. To volumes. Get a trigger volume. I'm going to adjust the size. Save that. Now I'm going to open the level blueprint. Make it a little small. That way you can drag in your cutscene level sequence. And then click on your trigger volume. And then right click. Get the on actor begin overlap event. Now from here do it do once. And then from the other actor cast to your third person character or whatever you're using. Plug that in. And then we're going to go from the character here. And we're going to disable the input. And then we're going to add, grab the level sequence. Play the sequence. Plug that in. And now we're going to get the duration and then the delay. Plug that in. And now after the delay, we're going to go from the character again. And enable the input. And then you can save that, close that, test that out. And it's playing the cutscene. And then when it's over, I can move around again. Thanks for watching.